Hello there, good morning from Las Vegas. I am here, I got here yesterday and so far it's been great, it's been amazing. It's been a long time since I've vlogged. I took a little bit of a break, mostly because didn't really have anything that was going on. But we're in Vegas now, we've got things going on, so it only makes sense to vlog. Um, I got coffee this morning at the Starbucks in my hotel. It's actually pretty good. I've got a croissant and I've just been chilling out for a little bit and getting ready. Got my makeup on, did my hair, and we're gonna get ready to head out and go start walking around. Today I have um, the Titanic exhibit that I'm gonna go to. So that's where I'm headed this morning and I'm gonna walk there. Granted, it's like 99 degrees outside and it is almost 10 o'clock in the morning so it's gonna be hot but i put sunscreen on i'm gonna bring sunscreen with me i have my sunscreen chapstick um so that my lips don't get burned i have my water that i'm gonna bring i brought my brita water bottle we have a fan which honestly this is this is pretty legit we're gonna take it easy we're not gonna go too crazy the titanic exhibit i think is about 30 minutes away and then I'm gonna go from there I'm gonna walk to the Guy Fieri restaurant um, which is a little bit farther <laughs> but you know what um, my ears are so sensitive ouch um, I could use the walking anyways and if it gets to be too much I can always just get an Uber or a Lyft it's not really that big of a deal but yeah, so this morning is all about just kind of going out and exploring. I don't have too much planned because I really wanted to just take it easy and kind of go with the flow and, um, you know, go and do things as, you know, they pop up. I went to the Beatles show last night, the Cirque show, and it was so good. I'll put a couple pictures up here. Um, I didn't really get any pictures uh, just because I was enjoying it. But it was an amazing show. When we came to Vegas, however many years ago, we went to the O Cirque show, which was really good. But so far, Beatles definitely, definitely like the top in my opinion. Went to dinner last night with my friend, Dre, and her fiance and her mom and had a really fun time. We went to an all-you-can-eat sushi place. And yeah, it's just, I've had a really good, relaxing time so far. And I'm excited for the rest of the trip. So um, let's go ahead and start this venture in 100 degree weather. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs>
so I remember that earlier clip where I was talking and saying all that stuff about like, oh yeah, I should be able to walk, no problem, bro. <laughs> It was a problem. I got about probably half of a mile to my first place that I was going to, which was to the Titanic exhibit. And I just was like, I can't do this. <laughs> like it is, it was just so hot by that point. It had to be, I think a hundred degrees. And I could just feel my body just like, like, nope, we're not having it. And there's no way in heck I would have been able to make it. Uh, not only to, the Luxor, which is where the exhibit was, but I would not have been able to make it to the link, which is where I got lunch. Um, by the time I got there, I my body was just so done. Um, I was so dehydrated and like I drank three glasses of water and sort of ate my food. Um, I still have some, like I actually have most of it because I just couldn't, I was just so nauseous. Um, so thankfully my friend, she's got some stuff that she's got to do tonight. Um, so that means I get a nice chill night inside, just chilling out, probably not gonna go anywhere because I just don't really, I don't really want to. Plus I have a show tomorrow night that I'm gonna go to. And like I said, I have leftovers. There's a restaurant downstairs that if I order probably early enough, because they close it. And there's a restaurant downstairs. I'll order from there. We're just gonna have a nice night in, hanging out, chilling, which I'm honestly totally fine with. That's what I do on a normal basis anyways, but it is just too hot to be trying to do things. Um, so we're not going to. But the Titanic exhibit was so fun. I did do the King Tut exhibit as well. I decided last minute to do that. And that one was pretty good too. <laughs> Something that was really cool. Um, they did this at both places where before you start the exhibit, you take pictures. And you know, it's that typical tour stuff where you take pictures and then they charge you for them. <laughs> for the Titanic ones, they show, I was just curious. So I was like, all right, we'll see what they look like. So they showed them to me after, and I actually, I actually got a couple of them because I was like, you know what? I'm by myself um, and I did want to take more pictures this trip. And I don't think I've done a very good job of that, but I've also been dying most of today. So let's do this one. This one's cute. Um, so this is, it's like a green screen and they just put the different things on it. So this is me. Um, quote unquote in front of the grand staircase um which is like an infamous thing from the titanic um they had a really cool recreation of it but i couldn't take a picture of it so i got this and i was not going to stop and have them take a picture for me because as i was walking past it i saw a picture that the person had taken prior to when i was there and the quality looked so bad <laughs> like the background was so dark you can couldn't see anything so when i saw this and the fact that it looked really good i was like you know what that's great i love it so we got that one <laughs> this one is so funny oh my gosh I s just i can't i can't even it's a little blurry but that's okay it'll it's it's the sentiment is still there um <laughs> Like, what even is, what even is this? I don't even know, man, but it's funny. And it'll be a great memory someday. <laughs> I did have fun. I did enjoy um, what I did, um, but it's, it's just too hot. I took a cold shower. Yes, a cold shower. It felt really good. So I'm just gonna hang out in my like 60 degree room and just chill. Okay, so it's quite a few hours later. I have taken a nap and I'm wearing my cute shirt or sweatshirt that I got from the Beatles show last night. Um, it's pretty comfy. I've been drinking Powerade and trying to rehydrate. I've just been chilling out, watching Grey's Anatomy. I did take a little nap and I decided to get some dinner one cool thing, I mean, there's lots of cool things about Vegas, but one really cool thing is there is so many food options. Like there's so much food. Vegas is like a foodie stream. So I was looking on DoorDash because I'm like, I'm not about to go anywhere. I'm looking on DoorDash for something that sounded good. And 
they have a Jolly Bee. Jolly Bee. Which, if you don't know what Jolly Bee is, it's like, I'm pretty sure it's like started out as a Filipino restaurant, but obviously they've expanded since then and there are other places that have Jollibee um so when I saw that they had Jollibee I was like you know what I've actually never tried Jollibee even though I grew up on Guam um they didn't have a Jollibee in Guam until after I moved so when I saw that they had Jollibee I was like okay I gotta try something um I wanted to try the spaghetti that they've got like Filipino spaghetti is so good but I was not really all that hungry for pasta. Um, so I got a couple pieces of chicken. Here's the chicken. I got two regular and one spicy just because I don't know what their spicy is. And then I got a peach mango, peach mango pie, which that should be pretty good. Um, it's like the old McDonald's apple pie, how it used to be deep fried. That's what that is, but peach and mango. And then I just got white rice because again, I'm like, I'm hungry, but not that hungry. So I figured we could do a little taste test. Um, even though it's literally fried chicken, it's probably gonna be pretty basic, but I'm excited. So let's go ahead and try the original because why not, right? People like mukbangs. Ah. Bro, that is so good. Mm. And with the right, right, and with the right rice, yes. Okay, let's try the spicy, just for sake of the vlog. <clears throat> oh yeah, it's got a kick to it. <clears throat> Like not overwhelming, but it like hits the back of your throat kind of a kick. What? And then so here is the peach mango pie. Oh my gosh, that is so good. Whoo! Okay, Jolly Bee, what I tried. Ten out of ten. So good. I'm gonna eat and hang out. Probably watch some more Grey's Anatomy, or at least until my iPad dies. <laughs> and yeah, just continue relaxing. Which honestly, it's been great. It's been, I've loved it. It's been amazing. Thanks for watching. Uh, tomorrow I have the Princess Diana exhibit, which I'm super excited about. And then I'm going to go to the Michael Jackson show. So we have more fun stuff to do tomorrow, but again, not super jam packed. So that will give me time to just kind of hang out and relax and chill because Lord knows I need that. So thanks for watching. Until next time.